There are 12 systems in the body. Remember that similar cells form tissues, similar tissues form organs, different organs then interact to form systems. Different systems then work together to form an organism. In this video, we will learn about the 12 important systems in the body and how they function. Integumentary system, skeletal system, muscular system, nervous system, circulatory system, respiratory system, digestive system, excretory system, urinary or renal system, reproductive system, endocrine system, immune system. Integumentary system. This system forms the outermost layer of animals. It helps to protect what comes in and what goes out of the body. It consists of the skin, nails, hair and some glands. Skeletal system. This system consists of bones that helps to support the body and protects the organs inside the body. Bones also produce blood cells in the bone marrow. Muscular system. This system consists of muscles that help the body to move around. They do this by contracting and relaxing. There are three types of muscles in the body. Skeletal muscles, cardiac muscles and smooth muscles. This system is also referred to as the musculoskeletal system. Some muscles are attached to bones and they help to hold the bones in place. Muscles also help to move blood around the body. Nervous system. This consists of the brain, spinal cord and nerves making up the central nervous system and peripheral nervous system. The system works by sending electrical impulses around the body enabling them to move. Circulatory system. This system consists of the heart and blood vessels. The heart pumps blood around the body via blood vessels and removes any waste products. Respiratory system. This system works to provide oxygen into the bloodstream from the air which we inhale and releases carbon dioxide when we exhale. This occurs automatically without you even having to think about it. It's part of the autonomic nervous system. It's made up of the nose, the pharynx, the larynx, the esophagus and the lungs. Digestive system. This system works to process the food that's eaten into substances so that the body can use it as energy. In order to do this, the food that's eaten passes through the digestive system. There are many body parts and organs that have different roles in this system. The parts of the body involved are mouth, tongue, teeth, esophagus, stomach, pancreas, liver, gallbladder, small intestine and large intestine. This broken food that passes through the large intestine turns into solid waste material. This is then removed from the body via the process of excretion. This occurs in the excretory system. Urinary system or renal system. This system consists of the kidneys ureters, bladder and urethra. The kidneys receive unfiltered blood from the renal artery. The kidneys then work to filter the blood by identifying useful and waste products in the blood. The waste products and excess fluid in the blood is removed and released as urine. 
The urine produced travels down the ureters from each kidney into the bladder. The bladder stretches to store the urine and then contracts when releasing urine via the urethra. Reproductive system. This system differs in males and females. It's where the process of fertilization occurs. Endocrine system. This system consists of glands that help to regulate the processes in the body. The glands in the body are able to detect and distribute hormones around the body. Immune system. This is also known as the lymphatic system. It works to detect foreign cells and sends white blood cells to fight infections. Therefore, it's a very important part of our body.